na bully na na pagbantaan pa na magkakagulo sa West Philippine Sea. Kapal ng mukha nitong si Chinese Foreign Ministry spokesperson Wang Wenbin. Tinakot pa talaga ang Pilipinas. Sa video kasing inilabas sa publiko, muli na namang binomba ng water cannon ang resupply mission ng Philippine Coast Guard. Pagigiit ni Wang Wenbin, walang mali o masama sa pagbomba ng Chinese Coast Guard. Illegal at hindi anya nagpaalam ang Pilipinas na manghimasok sa kanilang teritoryo. Yes, kanilang teritoryo. Pero nasa loob ito na exclusive economic zone ng Pilipinas at libo-libong kilometro ang layo nito sa China. Nabobo na ata. Pero hindi lang natatapos dyan. Pinagbantaan pa ni Wang Wenbin ang Pilipinas na gagawin lahat ng China ang paraan mapigilan lang ang pag-aayos ng BRP Sierra Mad. Ibig sabihin ba nito ay pwedeng humantong sa gera o pananakop lang ito ng China? Talagang iinit ang dugo mo sa pinagsasabi nitong ni Wang Wenbin. Shang 严重违反国际法和中国与东盟国家签署的南海各方行文宣言 Naharap sa napakadelikadong sitwasyon ang Pilipinas na tila may inaantay lang na mag-click sa orasan at may sisiklab talagang gera sa West Philippine Sea. Nakatakot man isipin pero dapat labanan talaga to ni Defense Secretary Gibo Chodoro. Dito binigyan diin na mas papalakasin ng Pilipinas ang defense capability nito kung atakihin man ang Pilipinas ng China. We must remember that a strong defense is not merely a tool for confrontation, but a means to uphold peace, stability, and the rule of law. Make no mistake about it, the House of Representatives fully supports the position of President Ferdinand R. Marcos Jr. that we should continue to assert our sovereignty in the West Philippine Seas and that we should defend every inch of our territory. Our nation stands as the pivotal juncture where the ripples of global tensions are felt even within the serene waters of the West Philippine Sea. It is here that our brave men and women in uniform stand as sentinels of our sovereignty, safeguarding our nation's territory against the ceaseless tides of adversity. Representatives in the 19th Congress fully support the increased allocation for the defense sector under the proposed 5.768 trillion pesos 2024 national budget to bolster the country's capability in protecting its territorial integrity. Our commitment to safeguarding our territorial integrity and ensuring safety to our citizens remains unwavering. Nakakabahala ang pagbabanta ng China. Totoo yan. Pero dapat ba natin itong katakutan o dapat tong paghandaan? Kayo, handa ba kayong lumaban para sa ating bayan? Ikomento sa baba ang inyong salobin.